Getting into it, man. The wall is breaking down. The final phase of the final load test is about to begin as war engulfs over the underworld. Now, it's kind of crazy how, like, we just started Season 4 and, like, we're immediately getting into a war. But, like, it's been set up since Season 3. You can't say we're just getting into it out of nowhere, but it just hypes me up because there's 24 episodes in this season and we're immediately starting off with, like, a huge war. Crazy. Now, what's going on? There's, like... How many people under us? Like 30,000? Like so many people, tens of thousands of people. And then on our side, we have like 3,000. What is our plan? It's to get rid of the resources nearby in the area we're working on so that, you know, they can't use their OP arts. But like, I thought Dark Arts doesn't really need to rely on that. And then there's Alice. It's hinted that Alice is super OP beyond her being special when Kikoko said it. Apparently, Alice has surpassed all the Integrity Knights. There's a lot of, you know, rare resources near the area, and she went there and sucked it all up. So I'm going to expect, like, an Excalibur Noble Phantasm to happen from her. Let's begin today's reaction. Goblin. Titans. Giants. Ogres. This doesn't make sense to me. How the fuck are these ogres? It's, it's like Wolf Beast. Like, when I think ogre, like, I already know what an ogre is. It kind of looks like an orc. It, it, it's, it's like a fucking goblin orc hybrid thing. It's a, this is a werewolf. What the fuck is an ogre, bro? Pugilist, the martial artist. So, like, I wonder if these dudes are the people that Berkeley was mentioning. Because, like, here's the crazy shit. When Berkeley was hyping up the Dark Knights about how they're pretty strong and Berkeley had to come with, like, a new strategy to fight against them because they have combo attacks, I was like, whoa, the Dark Knights must be OP. But it turns out the Dark Knights are not even the most important people. The Dark Mages are, I think. There's, like, seven, eight separate fucking other factions that we never even knew that's part of the Dark, you know, side. So, kind of crazy shit. I wonder if these dudes are the ones that Berkeley fought with. Because, like, I'd assume they'd have fucking combo attacks with their fucking fist and shit. D.I.L. Your soul will be so sweet. Lipstick Fanatio. New people, right? Shaita Synthesis 12. New knights that I've never seen before. And this one that looks like Shinon, right? She got the Shinon hairs here. Is she scared? She is scared. She's very... I mean, this is the normal reaction to have. And then... Arisu on the dragon. Amayori, bro. We should... Like, we should straight up had... Like, why the fuck is Eldry not in his dragon? Like, both dragons, as soon as the gate comes down, you should initiate with fire breath attack. Why are you not camping this point and just bombing them with your dragons? This is fucking stupid, Eldry. Excalibur charging. <laughs> this is the funniest shit. Kirito with Tisa and Roni at the back, like, why the fuck are they on the battlefield? You know? For ease of access when Alice is in trouble and Kirito will wake up, right? But like, it's crazy that they brought him to the fucking back line, man. The gate has been breached. I feel like this is a little bit of a personal jab. I wasn't like, yo, RSAO, Adicization, A1 Pictures, bro. Fuck Hollywood. <laughs> is A1 Pictures having fun with us right now? <laughs> like, yo, bro. We should start up our own anime studio! We could sell these! Oh my god, we'd be billionaires! Yeah, you're right, you would be! The roleplay, bro. Thank god the Dark Territory people are just a bunch of bloodthirsty warmongers because like bro literally just like stepped in as Dark Lord Vecta, Dark God Vecta and just like had a pretty good speech but it was so generic about just killing everything <laughs> and no one questions him. But the Dark Knights did, right? Dark Fanatio and Berkeley did but like this guy is just like the roleplay is on point. 
中林せよおお第一陣突撃開始ドラゴンバブルうるさいはい。The human guardian army skies above only Alice and Amayori. Yeah, Excalibur, you ready? Again, I just feel like this is such a lost opportunity. Like, like bro, it's just field day. You have Amayori plus Eldria's dragon just fucking fire breath on this shit. Like, What is that? Isn't this just easy pickings, man? Whatever. Yeah, or, or like fucking a landslide from above if you just roll fucking boulders down from the sides. Like, we have such an advantageous point because even if we're outnumbered again, it goes through this choke point. We have so much creative avenue to do, but we're just gonna let him hit us? Like, all right. <laughs> Battle of the Night. Fire arrows! Do s o v o l backstory? Rings? I see rings on fingers. His wife? Watashi ni wazuka ni noko sareta kako no danga. Kanojo ga katsute watashi to tomo ni krashita. Wouldn't it be funny if he just got trampled right now by the goblins? Bro, now is not the time to be having a fucking monologue and a backstory, bro. They're literally in your face. Here we go! Oh, Eight hells, hells at once! Armamento! Shikai! Whenever this guy is doing something, like A1 Pictures has to spend so much more than their, their budgets, bro. The flame animations are so crazy. I mean, Dusavolt is pretty much doing what the dragons I hoped would do, right? This is basically breath attacks. Everyone just getting annihilated. Giant's next! Fanatio got range skills too. Did Fanatio aim like this before? Because I know Kirito did. Is Fanati copying Kirito or Kirito always doing this shit? I'm not sure. Alright, we're going to hunker. Even to hell? Let's go, Fanati. a r r a n g e the attack. Show me it. There we go. Oh, oh. Barely does, I think. Close, close. Oh, oh. The kids. The green girl, right, green girl? 
まだ騎士としては新米だし、yeah, その後ろのレンリッチ。Yeah, Ren, like, she is panicking. Or maybe this is all a fake out, and, like, in the battle, in the heat of the battle, she's actually super OP, and we're getting, you know,、uh, I don't know, we're getting misled here, but it's looking pretty bad. Oh, it's a he. I see, it's a he. Okay, it's, we got a trap here. Oh, Niwa, who killed the tiger in the cave? So, stay on up, hang your son, kill it away, must ne? What is the kids? The kids about to go back and stab. <laughs> Kirito? Like, what was that smile? <laughs> Whip their asses! Oh shit! Fucking idiots! What the fuck? They run on all fours? Okay! Like, I feel like if he was more competent, he could have used his fucking whips to like hit the fucking smoke bombs before they landed in mid air, and then we wouldn't have all this fucking chaos like this, man. Come on, bro. Yo, maybe Eldre is bought off. Maybe l j is fucking flat off and he's intentionally doing this shit. Nah,、no, I don't think so. I think this is just incompetency. Friendly, careful! Friendly left? Friendly literally said fuck this war and walked off? No shot! No, no, he forgot his sword. No, Renly forgot his divine object. He's gonna come, come back in about five minutes, okay? We still have Dusa Volt though.、Oh! <laughs> Dusa Volt is just straight up hard carrying right now, bro. <laughs> why, is he, why is he not on his dragon? Straight up, I think that this is so fucking stupid how we only have Amayori here. Every fucking integrity knight has a dragon. They have breath attacks. Even if not, like, he could straight up be out in the, instead of being in the front lines, he could be hovering in air on a dragon and shooting rather than being in danger like this. Yujiu Senpai straight up just graduated high school and is now doing way better than existing fucking integrity nights, bro. Fucking embarrassment. Man, where's Volo at? Yo, where the fuck is Volo at? You remember Volo? Yo, put h u m b e r i a n here. Let h u m b e r die in the front lines immediately. What the fuck? This is still Fanatio's side, I think. Fanatio's snipe. I could have been you, man. Lucky. Wow, they're, they're, they're terrorized. He's glitching! He's glitching! What the fuck? His blood light! <laughs> Looking like Ryos, bro. Because Ryos also fucking, you know, was bugging out before. And he also just, you know, jumped like this into the bed. But interesting. What is the glitch happening? Because they're monsters. They're bad people. And monsters should not feel fear. Because he felt fear, it went against. Like, Ryos glitched out because he was trying to fucking break the taboo index, but he couldn't. And it, 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 this, like, conflict in his mind made him blow up. But here, his fear as a monster is causing him to bug out. Interesting. <laughs> Yo! The ping! What the fuck? 
I don't even know when he's attacking! He's on like 500 MS! What the fuck? Whoa! His flock like reach Fanatios? I don't know what this purple beam is supposed to, you know, describe, but clearly that's why Fanatio can't move right now. Huh. Bitch, he's still- he's bugging out so hard, he is literally taking 10 seconds to attack Fanati to do something, but she can't. She's frozen right now. Oh, the four heavenly blades! Fucked up, bro. Oh my god, that is rough. What? What the fuck? Yo, I gotta put some respect on the four heavenly knights. So far, they just been like fodder NPCs to filler, add, you know, the fucking 31 integrity knight number quota, but like, damn, that could have just. Went crazy. That whole sequence was insane. I don't think there's gonna be any other character that's gonna have this level of like insanity or the supporting characters. Like, what the fuck? Where did this come from? Now, is this move specific to Dakira? This blue flame attack? I'm just gonna think that it's some sort of mental image or her belief or her desire to protect Fanatu that created this overwhelming power here. Is he still gonna be bitching? Dude, that kid might just die. Dude, I swear to god, if Dakira says some corny shit about Milady, stop crying. Your beautiful makeup will be ruined. Then croaks, bro. <laughs> That's gonna be some corny shit like how Kita said, Who do you put that lipstick on for? Here we go. <laughs> Dakira's last words? Oh, she was like her biggest idol? Dude, Dakira went crazy there. Sad. That's fucking stupid. I'm not sorry. I'm sorry. Like, the three heavenly blades charging into the fucking army of ogre titans right there is fucking stupid right now. What are you doing? The glitching guy! He's still glitching! is so good. The soundtrack is fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> Yo, I thought that this would be what Alice is gonna do. I thought her release recollection is just this indiscriminate attack of light attacks, right? But this shit's looking like a fucking Excalibur right now. Damn! Right, just go like this. Right, just go like this. No, 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 no. Keep it on. Why are you getting rid of it? All you have to do is just do this now. Fanatio could literally win the war by herself. You just do this. Just, 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 and, and everyone die, bro.
have been Humber. You why why are you doing this random soldier that's dirty? This should have been Humber, bro. Put him in the fucking front lines. <laughs> I think they reused this scene. I, I'm pretty sure they've reused this scene every time. Am I am I crazy? Or is this like the third or the fourth time they've reused? It's peak, but it's like, come on, bro. <laughs> this is their first wave, bro. They got more ready to go. We got no more arrows. What the fuck? Yo, are they using their fallen comrades as shields right now? They are. It's meat shields. Wolf. Versus. Kisama wa ankoku ka ichikko no hitori. Goblin zoku no Osaka. Ibori sama da. That's rude, bro. In a duel, you need to acknowledge each other's names and titles. No release recollection, just base sword. Oh, yo, these dudes don't play fair, huh? Using your own ally as a fucking distraction to stab through. I mean, he was pretty much already dead, but goddamn. No. Let's go, you just had my. Man, he is pretty strong. We, we, I, all right. The Flatland Goblin, or, dude, yeah, I mean, he just fucking deflected him in one strike like that. It's, it's pretty fucking strong. Someone else show up now. Ooh, who's it gonna be? Oh! <laughs> Fuck the arrows, bro. Fuck the arrows. I'm gonna shoot my goddamn fucking sword. You know? <laughs> you should have shot the fucking goblin. Just pick up a fucking goblin corpse. Shoot the fucking goblin, bro. But also, his release recollection doesn't need arrows, right? He can simply shoot fire itself, right? Hold on! Look at the height of the attack relative to the goblin's head. And look at this right under. Shouldn't he be fucking burnt up too? <laughs> nah, fuck it, who cares? I think the MVP of today's episode is Dakira and Dusselvolt. Yeah, Fanatio was sick for sure, but uh, Dusselvolt has been just putting in work in terms of KDA, like he has the most kill count, and then Dakira for her heroic moment. Also, the biggest hell right now is that Renly kid. <laughs> Renly just straight up ran away. I'm really gonna take a shit, okay? You gotta take a pick a poop break, all right? Go pick up his sword and go take a poop and come back, all right? Oh. Nice, two factions down. Goblins down. This is only phase one, man. Oh, shit, I forgot about their dark dragons, too. Fuck, I forgot, I forgot. And minions, remember those things that we saw on the outside of the cathedral? Also, did that, did that ever matter? Like, remember in season three when we were climbing up that shit 
And I was like, oh, the minions exist. I'm like, oh, maybe they're going to try to tie it up with like Quinella and she's using Dark Arts too. But like, is, is that ever going to get closure? Or does that, is that just another thing that SAO just kind of throws in and just like, oh, psych, I forgot about it. Who cares? We move on. Their luck lights, their carcasses. Arisu. Oh, she's absorbing them. Is she absorbing this shit right now? I think she is, right? It's going up to her. But she's charging up. Hang in there, guys. Amayori. Breath attack. Yo, why is the boss team playing? The sacred resources! Is she about to drop a spirit bomb? Okay, Renly! Alright, Renly poop break! Alright, Renly, where are you at? What are you doing? Renly, you taking a shit? What are you doing? Really just traumatized. What are you doing here as a fucking knight? Why did they even pick you? They gotta be doing something with this character, right? They they they, they gotta be doing. You can't just introduce this character like that that runs away. That's also an existing integrity knight. He must be powerful, but just has like confidence issues. So like once we can fix that, maybe he'll pop off in the next episodes. But that's pretty much it, man. First episode of the war, and goddamn, it is peak. The soundtrack, the animation, amazing. And as I have said. MVP of today's episode goes to Dusselvolt and Dakira. Dusselvolt just doing everything that I said, you know, the dragon should be doing. Just going out, just clearing out the goblins, bro. Eldre, fucking L as usual. Fanatio was pretty sick, but Dakira, bro. This whole sequence of Dakira versus the Titans, the Giants, that shit was crazy. Now there's three Heavenly Blades, man. It is what it is. Now, even though the first wave seems to be pretty good for us so far, right? It does look pretty good, but just remember, this is simply the first wave of the attacks. They heavily outnumbered us, and they've, they only sent in three tribes, which is just like the both mountain and flatland goblins plus the fucking giants. The real fighters have yet to show up, and we are... I hope we're gonna able to hold that when they arrive. And at the end, remember what the game plan. Sacred resource. Alice is gonna suck that shit up, and... I don't know what this is. It looks like a spirit bomb. A metallic coat is covering the sun. She about to drop that shit on them and we'll see what happens next time. And that's it for me. If you're still here though, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.